Alright, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to some more Super Mario Maker 2. I hope you're on Fantastic Day. My name is Rose here, and today we're going to be doing something very different. Um, I think I'm just going to say F the, you know, the story mode to this because, honestly, I made three more episodes after the second one, and it, it was quite boring, to be honest. Like, it's not that I don't want to edit, it's just there's, like, so much stuff that, like, I ended up just sitting there and playing through the level because there's nothing to talk about. But, oh, she almost dropped my controller. Um... Today, we're actually going to be doing the top five uh, most popular speedruns. Now, obviously, these probably aren't going to be necessarily speedruns. They might just technically be uh, short second, uh, like short second little puzzle things. I'm not sure. I haven't played through any of them. But first off, we have Slippery uh, Stalactite. Oh, I guess the little icicles, technically. 20 second on and off speedrun using the on and off switch. Uh, sp small brain trolls. Fishbone and clear condition is to touch the goal. I, I don't know really what that means, but we're gonna start off with slippery stock. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that. But um, anyways, we're gonna jump straight into this. The world record is a minute and ten seconds. So maybe this isn't actually too much of a speed run. I don't know. We're, we're you know we're obviously gonna see. Now I might there's videos like this will actually I'll probably end up having to edit. Okay, so this actually isn't even a speed run. What am I supposed to do? Huh. If this isn't even an actual speed run, then I'm probably not even gonna do this. Oh, oh, that's pretty cool. I didn't know. Wow. So there's actually. I, I, I might just include this in it. Sorry, I got really. That's that's really cool. I didn't know that sliding actually has gives you a smaller. Uh, Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Um, it gives you smaller space to go through, you know, smaller space. That's really cool. I didn't know that. So when you slide, you actually can go through that little gap. But when it comes to... Wow. So when it comes to walking through that little gap, you can't actually do that. That's that's amazing. I didn't know that. Wow. Obviously, I didn't know that since I'm amazed by it. But like... Fuck, I, mean, I completely missed that. But damn, that's really... Uh... How do you, I don't know how to really explain it. That's something I've never actually, you know, seen. As, uh, as far as the few videos that I've watched, you know, Eric Van Milderman, uh, Rat You Car and stuff, but that's really cool. I, I'm really amazed by that. Like, the things that people find out are, uh, how do you say it? The things that people find out are ridiculous. Okay, I really need to just jump there instead of trying to spin jump. Because a spin jump is, a little bit easier to maneuver with because uh, you get the same height basically every time and I didn't hold down the slide button so this really isn't too much of a speed run by time wise but this is a speed one a uh, speed sorry I'm still trying to get used to my voice and everything um, this is more of a speed run and uh, based off of you know the game mechanics and stuff so that's just pretty cool so I guess we'll technically count this as a speed run there we go. Okay, I didn't have to crouch uh, all those times that I did, but I did anyways. So this. Um, okay, I don't. Huh? I held down the. What are you supposed to do there? It doesn't seem like you like pick up any momentum at all. Call it. Okay, I need to, I need to trust the level. I need to stop being a little. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm trying to chill with the cuss words, but uh, it's just trust it. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. See, I, 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 that's all I have to do. I just have to trust it. Please give me a checkpoint. Yes, a checkpoint. Okay. I slide through here. Okay. So now. Oh, okay. Now it's an actual. Now we gotta kind of speed on this. Go, Mario! God! He's so retarded sometimes. Okay, so sliding doesn't affect the icicles hitting you? Or does it? 
because I was sliding while they were falling on me, but... Yeah, they don't affect you. Okay, so you gotta run there. You really just have to trust this level. Yeah, you gotta trust the slides. You have to trust the slides or else you're screwed. And here isn't too difficult. Oh, yo, that is, oh, that's such a butt clincher. And that's the end of the, I was gonna say end of the video. That's the end of the, the level. GG, okay. Oh my God, you really have to trust the slide in that section of the level. Holy crap. That last part is such a butt cl Okay, I'm gonna like that. That was just pretty fun. It's just a little... That last little icicle really had... Oh my god. That's crazy. Slide and destroy ice. Watch out for falling static. Okay, that that's that's pretty smart to put, but really they're just icicles. I, don't, I guess icicles count as stalactites? I don't know. Alright, next we're on to 20 second on and off speedrun. So, yeah, a shell throwing 20 second speedrun course based around on and off... Oh crap. The clear rate is 0.98, 7,000 clear. Okay, see, it's just a lot of people play it, but there's a lot of a lot of clears on it. The world record is 17 seconds. So I'm guessing it's not that tight of a speed run. Excuse me, I, I have the hiccups. That's why I sound kind of, you know, besides my voice, that's why I sound kind of stupid in between my sentences. So, okay, shell throwing. Please don't tell me I have to shell jump. I'm not used to it at all. I practiced it a little bit. Oh. Oh, I got Z jump. Crap. Okay, so okay, this isn't too hard. This is just a, more of like a popular level, more than a. I might actually do a. What? Oh, those are on. <laughs> those are switches on the top. I didn't know. I didn't notice that. I might go for the water. I get on here. Wow. So you actually gotta get it as much momentum as you can, or else I don't think you can. Oh, you really, you really have to have a lot of momentum going into that. So as soon as you turn back to throw this show, yeah, you have to turn so quickly for that because if you, the more frames you use or milliseconds, whatever you wanna. Oh man, that's really tight. That really is. Like that's by tight I mean like you have to Hold on. What? Wait, how does that work? Yeah, there it is. Oh. What? Okay, don't jump. Don't just don't jump. It's that simple. I'm sorry if I'm being really loud. I'll probably adjust the, whoops. I'll probably adjust the the audio. Yeah. Oh, okay. I need I need to jump a little bit more. I need I just need to trust it and quit being a little puss about it. I think I can say that because that's not the full word. Damn it, I tried to jump as late. Okay, that's why that coin is there, actually. I just noticed that a couple of tries ago. That's why that coin's there, so you can know that's when you need to jump, like right at the edge. Yeah. I I didn't even hold up. Oh my god, okay. Come on. What are I gonna do with that? <laughs> there was no indication of what I needed to do until I got there. That arrow doesn't help. I didn't. I. I obviously that was stupid of me to, you know, throw it upwards. Yeah, uh, when there was nothing there, I. I just kind of panicked and like expected a little bit too much. I anticipated uh, something that wasn't gonna happen. I don't even know what's uh, okay. I made a little bit of progress. I actually got I got the I got the off switch. I got the off switch, and so that, that you know that's progress. Oh, might be like one percent progress, but you know it's something.
All right, that's a little more consistent. Why did I Z jump? There was absolutely no reason for me to Z jump. Why did I do such a thing? Oh my god. There was absolutely no reason for me to Z jump. I have not Z jumped. I have not Z jumped that part the entire time. Why did I think I needed to do it that time? That was so stupid of me. I think what I did was I anticipated the the shell throw whenever you land after that uh, that next part. God, that was so dumb of me. I can't believe I did that. No! What? Okay, what do I gotta do there? Do I just jump? Oh, I guess I would get enough momentum from the... No, oh, you gotta see jump. Uh, I, I guess I would get enough momentum from the... The conveyor belts or whatever they call them. As soon as I hit... Okay, as soon as I hit that last off or on switch, whatever it is, then I have to jump. As soon as I hit it, I have got to jump because then that that conveyor belt launched me forward so I got to make sure to get off of that as soon as I can. Two, three, four. There we go. Should that be it? Yes, that's it. Okay. There's obviously a lot of stuff that I could do a lot faster than in that. But uh, holy crap, I finally got it. Right after I tell myself what I gotta do, I got it. Thank God. So I'm off by just a few. I might okay. After if I finish with enough time, I might come back here and try to get the world record. I don't think I'll be able to, but I don't know. It kind of seems like it's possible. So we're gonna go on to the next one: small brain trolls. 1.72 completion rate. World record is a minute and eight seconds. Okay, so this is again. This is another one that has like gives you a lot of time but it probably well I don't know oh you know what actually this isn't a speed run it gives me short and sweet did I leave that on there I did leave that on there no wonder we got that first one okay let's switch it up so we did those two Okay, so the third one is clear condition, touch the goal. Okay, so these two that I've already done are actually, you know, speed runs. World record is 34 seconds. Okay, that makes a little more sense. 1.14 completion rate. Okay, so I had a uh, short and sweet on. The reason being, uh, actually, that wasn't by accident. I had that on because, you know, I don't want uh, like a 100 second speed run. Oh, this is going to be like a, st okay, this gives you a lot of time, but this is going to be like a Kaizo kind of uh Oh, okay, yeah, this is definitely gonna be like Kaizo like. Uh, this is gonna be one of my first. Well, okay, I'm gonna lie if I say first Kaizo, but. So, what am I supposed Okay, I gotta jump on the Goomba. There's a spring right there, and it gets boosted off of that. And I don't have to. Uh... Okay, so this isn't actually too difficult. This is kind of like a training kind of Kaizo speed run, to be honest. This isn't too difficult. It's easy to understand. There. Toss that up. And there, there's a checkpoint already. Okay, so that's pretty. Oh, whoa. Okay, what do I got to do there? Oh, I got to use the... The shellman as a uh, as a hit. Okay, I have to land on the the thing. That's why it gives me a shellman, so that way I can take another hit. Because if it gives me a big, then that's gonna end up hindering me, so I won't have enough space. Okay, I gotta land on the back of the muncher in order to gain momentum while it's falling, so I can end up jumping up there. Okay, this is this is really cool. I like this level. There we go. Oh, okay. I completely missed it. But, I, you know, progress. I actually made it off of there. And, again, another thing. I apologize if you can hear me mashing the A button whenever I jump and stuff. Uh, that's just the controller. I can't do too much about it. That's just the way it is. I want to, like... I don't want to... 
Oh my god, I have to <laughs> I have to start all the way from here because I click start over. I forget there's not a start over from checkpoint thing. Even after all the Eric Van Wilderman videos I've seen. Okay, yeah, you had to keep spinning. Um he always complained on Mario Maker 1 that either you got to they got to put a start from checkpoint, but I didn't learn from that at all. Nope, I knew that wasn't enough. Damn, now I gotta do this whole thing again. But it's not like it's too hard. There we go. Okay, now we're back. Alright, so now with this thing. There we go. No, you gotta go the other way. Damn it. Okay. So now this part, this is kind of getting a little more tricky. Just because I said it was easy. Hold on. See, I've gotten that part down. Okay, you do, Okay, you need to land on that little spot. You don't really have to get, like, so much momentum. Okay, damn. Or you actually have to get that, or else you're going to have to go back a little bit. Okay, so I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, I guess I'm not going to know until I get revived again. So, uh, I should have paused it there and actually, you know, kind of scouted it out. Alright, so there. Oh, okay. I got to get the coin. And then land on Yoshi. I guess? Or do I... Please don't tell me I have to land on Yoshi meter. Oh. No, I can't. I want to start over, but I can't because it's going to take me all the way back to the beginning. There we go. Do I have to let go of him? I, I bet something falls there that I... That I have to land on. Let's see. I probably have to jump off of him and sacrifice him. Okay, I, I, I gotta click the button to let go. Or to get off of him. We're only at 24 minutes down. Huh? So I gotta keep Yoshi? Okay, so you have to time it perfectly because that spring is going to launch you. So that way, okay, so the spring is what gives you momentum. Because otherwise, you wouldn't be able to make that jump by just standing there. <sighs> How do you time that, though? That's a little... It's obviously timed. It's perfectly timed. But for me, it's a little awkward before I, you know, finish my sentence without any context. That's progress, technically. There we go. <laughs> oh my god, Mario. Dude, I got, okay. I got it, but I just didn't jump early enough. I jumped way too late. I kind of expected that once I got it, to be honest. Nope. I can't start over. Don't try starting over. Oh my god. I should have had that. I'm so I'm so butthurt. I'm very butthurt about that. I'm gonna be salty about that for the rest of the day. All right, come on. I'm glad this has checkpoint service. I'll be really offended. There we go. Oh, why did I go? Why did I go? Oh, come on. Why did I go? I rushed so bad. <laughs> I I don't know why I kept speed running. I had time to take a break and like scout out. Oh my god, please tell me I can get back there again. No. Oh my god. Okay, that's a little bit more consistent though. I did it twice and I jumped with Yoshi twice in a row, so that's progress, but man, I had it. Why did I rush it? I'm such an idiot. Oh my god, I am so mad about that. Why did I rush? I had all the time in the world, well, 200 and something seconds to wait there and see what I had to do next. Okay. 
So usually they tell you get you out of Z jump, but Z jump, but doesn't look like I have to do that. Oh, okay, I know what I have to do. Okay, that wasn't man. I'm s <gasps> the end is right there. Oh come on! Oh my god! I didn't have all the time in the world right there at all. Oh, it's right there. I was, oh my God. The end was right there. Should I make this just a top three? It's probably gonna be too long if I do top five. Just because of the fact that. Okay, jump, jump. Okay, I gotta wait though, cause something falls here. Oh, okay. Oh my god. I can't believe I did that. I'm so dumb. Wow, awesome level though. That was really fun. I can't believe I actually like got the hang of it though. Obviously, this is probably like, you know, amateur stuff for like riding a car and stuff. But, uh, you know, to me, this is, that's incredible. Alright, uh, we're at 30 minutes. Um, I'm gonna try to do these two levels. Oh, this one's 20 seconds. I don't know how long this one is. Wait, let's let's see. Okay, 43 seconds is the world record. Let's do it. Who cares? If it's past 30 minutes, whatever. I'm not even gonna stress about it. This is... It's how my first long-ass video on here. Oh, no, you got... Oh, I still hit it! Oh my god, that would've been so clutch if I wall jump. Oh my god, I still hit that P. Okay, so this is... This is really just a... A little P level. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That was really retarded. That was so dumb of me. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure I could do this level within the... Time that I want. Oh, I completely missed it. No, <laughs> God, man. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, I can do this though. This isn't anything. I'd rather do that than wall jump, to be honest. Oh, that was bad. And I need all the time for this. Yeah. Ah, uh, I was gonna try and wall jump off of that and hit the P and then keep going. I, I'm pretty sure that's possible. Oh my god, I was literally off by a split second. I should triple jump. I, I really, if I would have triple jumped, I probably would have gotten over it. Cause why not? There might be a couple of things I could do faster there, honestly. I might know what they are, but I'm not gonna risk it because so far I'm doing that far well. Poor Mario. It's a well put together level, but. I feel like there could be like stuff that's added to it. Just like design wise, at least. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk it. Whew, I almost missed that by trying to turn around. Yes, and that's it. Let's go. Alright. That was a really fun level. I really liked that one. But, you know, just design wise, I feel like stuff could have been added because all it is is just clouds and a bunch of blocks. But it was a really fun level, like, play gameplay wise. Wow, I was off by a lot. <laughs> I was off by 12 seconds. Alright, let's go on to this last level and we'll go ahead and end the video. Monster Dash 20 seconds. I might just do the next top, honestly. Wait, how? 593 out of 100? 93.93% complete rate. Completion rate, sorry. And it's an. Okay, the world record is. 
point zero seventy eight seconds less than the time limit. Oh, that that that's gotta screw me over. That has to screw me over. Oh my god, I killed the bonsai bear with a pow, but <laughs> I killed what I killed him with the pow, but I didn't throw the pow at the wall, so it didn't activate. Okay, I don't need to jump there. That's gonna screw me over a lot. Okay, I d I'm pretty sure these are just spin jumps. I need to trust the spin jumps instead of just trying to jump my normal ways. Yeah, okay, just a normal spin jump. That's all it takes. Okay, I, I gotta, you know, do it a little bit later. This isn't too difficult. This is gonna be tight. That's gonna be the problem, for sure. I'm trying to get as many frames as I can can like to save why <laughs> why am i spin jumping so okay maybe i don't i don't know i gotta i gotta figure that out i try to get in the door as early as possible see now that was a short spin jump why did i why did why am i doing it differently i either get the timing wrong Oh, why did I slow down there? At least I got that though. Ah, oh, I gotta take that power with me. Dude, let me let me jump on the P. God. There we go. Now take this with me. What? That little. I know. I okay. I know. I know why that happened because I threw it so late that what I ended up doing was killing the bottom spiky with the pal, and then the pal, well, the pal didn't have enough time to activate because I had already died by the little spiky. Okay, I just used up a lot of time right there. Yeah. See, now that one kills the top spiky because it activated before anything. Save some time on that one. No, that's not why. Do I have to give it some time then? I might have to give it a couple. Of, okay. I was completely wrong about why I died. Why did I wait so long like a freaking idiot? Can I actually, do I need to wait to throw the power or can I go ahead and trust throwing it early? I don't know. Oh my god! What? How? Oh my god, I was right there! I was so quiet about that too, because I thought I had it. What do I gotta do faster? I gotta get in the door faster? No, this for sure ain't it. No, oh no, this de definitely isn't it. Wow, that is really tight. Holy crap. What are I gonna do differently then? It might be the frames that I'm letting go of Y to let go of the power. Because letting go of the power, Y is what, uh. Oh, that was so dumb of me. Y is the running button, but it's also the carry button. So I would assume when you let go, it might slow you down by just a split second. And considering the world record is that tight, uh, that might just be the reason why. <laughs> what? I was touching. Oh, what? I was in the axe. <laughs> oh my god. Mario's whole body was inside the axe. How? <laughs> I am mind blown. What is the hitbox for the axe?
Oh my god! What is the hitbox? Get indoors as fast as you can. What? Yeah, when you let go of Y to throw the power, you actually lose a little, little bit of momentum. You can you can just barely tell. Dude, there's no way. <laughs> I am so short of it. How? What can I do faster? Do I gotta spin jump to it or what? Me inside of that axe is definitely what the thumbnail is gonna be. Oh, it says 4,000! Wait, it says, dude! Oh my god! I'm not supposed to be yelling, but it said 4,000. I clearly got it. Okay, I'm not the best editor. I don't know how to zoom in yet. I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna try to figure that out. I was inside. I was inside of the, the goal. Again, I made it. It says four thousand. It clearly says 4,000. It clearly said 4,000, which indicates that you touched the goal and you have completed the level. I am missing it by a frame. By a full frame. No, man. Dude. <laughs> It said 4,000. Besides killing these enemies, there's no other way to get points in this level. Or in this game. Or, no, yeah, actually in this level, besides touching the end of the level. <laughs> no, no, I can't do it. I, I'm, ba I'm baffled. I am so confused. There's got to be a secret to it. Or just... Oh my god! You... I hit the shell a little bit later at the end there. Just to keep my momentum going for as long as I possibly could. I made it by 0 .013 milliseconds. That's why it's called Monster Dash. I thought it had to do with a bunch of enemies, but no. It did, but not what... It, oh my god. Wow. And you can do it. I don't I don't know the math there, but compared to the world record, you could do it by about point zero fifty. I don't know, but yeah, point zero fifty something uh, milliseconds faster. Wow, that is incredible. I really hope this recording doesn't mess up because this is gonna be one hell of a video. I don't care how many views I get on it, but that that level was in incredible. I cannot believe that. Wow, that is insane. I cannot, I'm so mind blown by that. The amount of times I hit 4,000, it said, <laughs> yeah, see if you can beat this course in under 20 seconds. See if you can do it. Because that is hard as shit. The level itself isn't hard. The time frame is incredibly tight. Wow. My throat is going to be hurting later just because of how much I was yelling. Holy crap, Hamburger. 
course ID 3VK WW4Y1H. For those of y'all that are just getting into Mario Maker, just like me, try this level out. Wow, that is amazing. Hamburger, amazing level. You are a brilliant level maker. The fact that you were able to make a level that tight, that is insane. There's no way you're gonna beat that world record without some little, you know, uh, exploits. Like some sort of like frame exploit so you can get into the door, door the door faster or like throw your power without losing momentum or something. But wow. Anyways, that's gonna be the end of the video. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna title this, but it's definitely gonna have something to do with this level because holy crap. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If it did, leave a thumbs up and if you don't like, click that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. And go check out this level and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.